Hey everyone, Kita Sean here. So these last couple of days for Fade Grand Order have been crazy, and these next couple of days are still gonna be crazy for Fade Grand Order because well we just recently had the Famitsu issue drop and uh, a bunch of stuff came out from that. I mean we had interviews with Nasu, the creators, Takeuchi. Uh, we had uh, Nissan and other staff members and voice actors. A lot of information. Uh, what goes behind the scenes of Fate's Grand Order, like the development team and stuff like that. Uh, NA just recently got the Summer 3 event that just dropped. And in a couple of days, we have the anniversary. Like, literally, like that's going to be super, super exciting. But what I want to talk about in this video is the upcoming Summer 2020 event for Fate Grand Order JP because, well, we got a new hint on this upcoming event. I mean, we've been getting hints little by little uh, these last couple of months. I mean, Mashu had a voice line um, hinting that it might be a bit spooky, so we all are speculating that it might be a uh, Kimo Damashi themed uh, event. And then Nasu in the Famitsu magazine said that they're going to try a different genre this year for summer because uh, this is also a, a genre that's celebrated during the summer. So that obviously told us, oh, is it Kimo Damashi? Is it really a horror theme this year? Because in Japan, horror is celebrated in the summer. So um, yeah, as we're you know hoping for that to happen, uh, Mashu here, this drops a bomb. She has a new voice line if you guys did not notice, but uh, let's go ahead and listen to that because this is actually a hint on where we're going for this upcoming summer 2020 event. That's not it. Hold on. Here it is. It's not, it's not about the ocean. It's also about climbing the mountains, going camping, watch nature, play in nature. There's also that type of genre. That sounds really fun as well. So, Mashu probably just confirmed that we're heading towards the mountain this summer. So, we're going camping. And if we're going camping, the chances of Kimo Damashi happening uh, is very likely. So, a uh, horror themed summer event is really, really high here. Like, it's, like, it's a really good chance that we're getting camping slash horror this year. So, that's very exciting. Um, speculation of Arishka Gill uh, becoming a uh, summer servant this year is 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 pretty solid. It's, it's a good chance that she might be a summer servant this year. Now, um, it's not confirmed, but there's also a pretty good chance that it might be a summer festival. I mean, personally, for me, I would love to see Yukata servants. Uh, I love uh, the uh, Yukata fashion, so it'd be really awesome to see that. I mean, I'm pretty sure a lot of uh, male fans would love to see their favorite female servants see, uh, you know, dressed up in cute yukatas, and uh, female fans uh, would love to see male servants in, you know, yukatas. So that'd be really, really awesome to see. But I think um, the chances of that is slimmer than, you know, a horror event. So yeah, Mashu just dropping bombs here, man. Like she's just hinting and teasing us on the upcoming summer event. Um, I do believe that this upcoming anniversary stream, we will have a little teaser on the upcoming summer uh, event like they do every year. So uh, look forward to that. Uh, of course, I will be streaming the live stream. So uh, come by and uh, listen to me translate. Uh, other than that, um, I will be uh, taking topics from the Famitsu magazine and making them into video formats so that uh, you guys can enjoy. So look forward to that as well. But man, summer is going to be in the mountains this year, guys. That's pretty crazy. So there's a, a good chance that we're not getting swimsuits. That's pretty insane. <laughs> uh, we might get you know the servants in like camping outfits. We might get them in like, uh, I don't know, horror outfits. Uh, we might get them in yukatas, who knows, but I, I think there's still a pretty good chance that we might get swimsuits because, I mean, there are rivers, streams in the mountains, so maybe they can play in the river or the streams, you know, in swimsuits, who knows. But uh, what do you guys think? Are we still getting swimsuits this year? Is Arishka Gil finally coming as a summer servant? Are we getting that horror theme? Are we getting yukatas? What do you guys think? Comment down below and tell me what we 
are getting this upcoming summer but it does look like we're heading towards the mountains which is actually very very exciting so i cannot wait to see but anyways thanks for watching hope you guys enjoyed and i will see you guys in the next one laters